Shannon Williams, and my question is, does artwork have the ability to reveal pieces of a person's character or personality? I plan to investigate my question through a series of different personality drawing tests that I have found, and it will cover a cross-section of different people from children to adults. Uh, there is one test that involves drawing people. They draw a man, a woman, and themselves, and from studying this picture, you can learn different things about their intellect and about their feelings. And then there's another one where they draw a house, a person, and a tree. And from this you can learn similar qualities about them and any other tests that I find uh, throughout my investigation. The reason I would like to answer this question is because I see myself putting my own personality into all of my different art pieces, which is why I would like to see if others' personality can be put into their artwork subconsciously without them thinking about it, because creativity is one of the hardest things to analyze, but which is why it's one thing that I would really like to try to crack into. This is my latest art project that I finished my senior year. Uh, it's of Johnny Depp, and I chose Johnny Depp because he is my favorite actor, because I think that he nails absolutely everything he tries to do, and I admire him for that. This is my UD poster. I did it on my favorite sports team for as long as I can remember. My family have been Flyer Faithful, and I have followed the team ever since I was old enough to know what a basketball team was. So when we had the chance to do a advertisement, I chose this and it's one of my favorite things I've ever done. Um, this is my exit project from 8th grade. We had to take our face and put it in any painting classic that we wanted and I had to choose one of Degas' uh, dancers because I was always the artist that I looked up to the most because he always depicted dancers so beautifully and I've been a dancer since I was six years old so to be able to put myself into one of his paintings as one of his dancers was something I've always wanted to do. For as long as I can remember, I've always been a doodler. I doodle on everything. When I need something to do or keep my hands busy, I pull out a sheet of paper and pencil and just go to town. Um, I do stuff at home. I do stuff at school. My notes are covered in them. My agenda book everything. People think I'm the most scatterbrained ever, but really it's just I have too many thoughts that I have to record at once. And it helps me get everything out and put stuff down on paper, get it off my mind, or let my mind wander with it, whatever I feel like doing at the time. I hope to be a UD Flyer in the near future and be an art education major because I love to work with kids. And I am also this year currently as my senior exit project studying uh, art therapy and its effect on children and analyzing to see if it actually works, which I'm also very excited about, which I think can also connect to this question as well and might actually help my research in this area and maybe one day I'll be able to create my own uh, personality drawing test to continue this investigation on for the rest of my life. Thank you for this opportunity.